What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. We're ahead of the hurricane right now, trying to hit the Tampa Slam with Captain Jason. His information's in the description. We're going for snook, trout, redfish, let's go. Starting the morning off throwing out some fish food here, trying to get some bait, some bait to migrate over towards us. We're gonna grab a bunch of that and then I think we're gonna go for some snook, maybe some redfish today and see what else might be on the agenda. I should probably clean the lens, y'all are looking a little fuzzy. <laughs> we're seeing fish jump all over though. This is nuts, birds are working. It's gonna be a day. <laughs> Got the goods. <laughs> I think like I know some guys who do a, a like a hat mounted GoPro and that could be real good because you no matter where you're at then you're on film but not also or I'm sorry but not only that but you're also getting good audio like if you're saying something yeah. it's gonna be heard yeah that's the one thing with more cameras then it's more cards then it's more editing then it's more everything you know what I mean so it's always a toss-up it really is there you go is it <laughs> Devin's on with their first snook you gonna get him or what oh shoot you the same dude? Yeah. Nice. The same dude. Oh, oh, no. oh, that was about to be Devin's first snook ever. <laughs> Funny, yeah, we're just getting things started, man. We're pulled down. We don't have to work the trolling motor. We're literally just locked on this spot, trying to cast into these mangroves, get as close to these leaves as possible, really, out with Captain Jason. See if we can't get on some snook, some redfish maybe later today, or, well, I don't, you said there's redfish back in here. Yeah. So there, here so there might be some reds in here. Uh, Jack cruising through. And whatever else, man, we're gonna see what hits. Whoop! There he is. <laughs> There's something popping over there. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Boop! Something big rolling. It looks like a shark. Definitely. Shark rolling through. He won't hit these, huh? Yeah. He will? Yep. Woo! <laughs> Wait, that's basically another word for hammerhead. So they are actually. Because uh, they look they dope. Cousin. To cousin. Hammerhead. Got it. Is it, is it like more rounded or something? That yeah, that face? Like it's, like it's yeah. Man, you know what you're doing. What the heck is going on out here? He's taking you in there though. Oh snap. You gotta get broke off a lot, right? Yes. I mean, my guy is cruising. Is that you? I think so. There we go. Got him? Let me get out of your way. Let me get out of your way. Nice yeah, that's a good enough. The slimy speckles. You grab most of these about the same way. Yeah. Like I see the under underside yeah, and pretty much everything has an algae in the mouth. Okay. Everything will bite you. Yeah. The gallon's the best. There we go. There's my first fish. There we go. Up in the boat. First one for me. So underside, huh? Yep. About a belly. Got him. We're just hooking these guys through the nose today. Seems to be getting the job done. Yeah, right there on the edge. Oh, there he goes, all right, there he goes. <laughs> I think so. All right, another trout. That's a deal. Look at those teeth. See you, bud. Oh yeah, that's the cast. Oh, yep, that was fast. He was waiting for it. That's gotta be a snook, huh? Cause he's deep in there. Yeah, it's a, that looks good. Uh-oh. Oh, 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 get him out of there, boy. He's putting up a good fight. This could get ugly. Ooh, he's not playing. Yeah, so I gotta see how you land it. That's sick. 
Nice. First redfish ever. That's so funny because like we've been needing to go down to the coast and try and catch one of these things and just like, like in Texas and uh, like it's not that far for us but we haven't done it. These are not the biggest of reds but we're gonna get a couple we're pictures for Devin anyways because that's our first one. This is pretty sick. All right, let's get it back in the water guys. New species for me. First redfish. Got it in the boat. I'm gonna try and get some maybe some bigger ones. I also got to get a snook at some point. Oh, oh, there you go. Devin's on with a decent snook, y'all. Here we go. Right? No, we got that trout in between. First ever snook for me. Super cool. Just changed spots. I changed, changed spots, what, 10 feet, 20 <laughs> yeah, feet away? Yeah, yeah. Just yeah. move locations. Uh, they're first cast, up, they're blowing up. We're going to get him back in the water. That's, oh, that's a good one, huh? I'm in trouble. <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> he took me for a nice little run there. <laughs> oh, God! Look at He's going airborne! <laughs> Looking solid. I'll take that right there. What did you say? He's probably 25, yeah, 26. 26. 26. Nice solid. That'd be like a 10-pound bass. We're used to fishing some ponds out there in Texas, so... Come out here, get on some snook for the first time ever. We're having fun. God, I love how they're lit up like that. So sick. All right. Biggest snook of the day for myself. We are getting on them out here. We've got a bunch of these in the boat. This guy's been munched too. Something has gone after him in his younger days. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> awesome fight. He literally took me up into the mangrove. I didn't know if I was getting this guy out. We're using a 20 pound fluorocarbon leader, some circle hooks, nice and stout. And uh, yeah, we're trying to get some more. Let's go for that big 40 incher. They're elusive, but we know they're here. See if we can't link up with a true giant, you guys. Nice, let's get some more. Oh, God dang, they're going nuts out here. It's a little, that's a tiny snook right there. Oh my gosh. Oh, baby. Oh, oh that bait. was on my bait. <laughs> that's funny, Devin's second snook. Double up on some snook, y'all. First timers out here in Florida catching on the snook. Let's go ahead and get them in the water. There they go. Now you just need a red. Yeah, you I need a red. Ah, oh, give me a red, she man. She got her Tampa Bay slam. I know. It is a micro I slam. Did. You did. It is a slam. Is, is a trout on there? Trout red yeah. snook. You're really? Slam. No way. You can call it the Tampa slam or is yep. it the, okay. Tampa Bay slam. That's what's up. So what's that out there? Something's munching. Do I have a fish? I do have a fish. <laughs> a little baby trout. Uh, is it? You're not supposed to be here, man. We're after the snook in this corner. All right. Another trout in the boat. That's all. Yeah, see, that's the connection. I know I got a fish. I got the, the tiniest micro, snook. Micro snook. Look at that little fish. Oh. <laughs> New species on the day. A micro ocean fish out here. What is going on? <laughs> Do you grab him from the belly as yep. well? Oh. Croaker. Croaking. He's got some spikes on the bottom side. Jack. Man, we might be almost, we're at like 10 snook in the boat now. To save some money. Snooksters. Oh, the bite, I think, is just getting started. They're just yeah. blowing up, man. The snook are all <laughs> over in this corner. It's only 9 o'clock. <laughs> yeah, this is nuts. The key to getting these snook, by the way, y'all, is getting as close as you can to the mangroves. Getting, like, in there. Because uh, these guys like structure. So, kind of like the bass at home. You see a little tree, a lay down, get in there. Oh, see? There we go. Quick blow up. So, you were s saying the snook is just like a quick thrash, a quick yeah. hit. And then something else is a body roll, like yeah, the, the, the trout. Will come up and the roll. trout kind of where their how their mouth shape is. Yeah. So if you're paying attention over here, you almost know what you're looking at. You can kind of see what's going on. Snook. If you look at the orientation of their eyes, they kind of sit on the bottom. And their yeah. eyes are pointing up. And okay. Mouth elongated. So they come up and like from the bottom and pop. Yeah. That's funny because we've been getting blow ups like right when you get your fish to hit the surface of the water. Boom. Snook on on a few of these casts here. Got him. I thought that was the spot, but I didn't want to say nothing. And then he broke off. Yeah, I set the hook. I messed that one up. I messed that one up. Line. There we go. Oh, that's actually a good one. Oh, he's going to take us in there. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Oh, my gosh. He's earning it. Oh, boy. Oh, no. We're in trouble on this one. He, he's got me way in. <laughs> we might be in trouble on this one. Okay, he's back out. This is what we want right here. I think this one's I think this one's at least a pound. <laughs> <laughs> He's thrashing too, check him out. Yeah, this is a bigger snook. Alright. This is the biggest one you got so far. Ooh. 
Will they sometimes get a, a big second wind? Yeah, like, and then he'll just decide to go crazy when he gets to the boat? First run is the biggest run. That's okay. Most important. If they, okay. If they wreck you in a branch, that's when you're going to break up. Okay, so we might get I, this one in I the was boat. Afraid of. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, pole. no, watch the power pole. All right, here. Very good. Yeah. Here we go. Solid. There we go. There we go. Biggest one for me. All right, y'all, we're going never been done before on the channel today. This is the new Guggen Explode Toad. We're gonna see if we can get a snook to explode on one of these bad boys. I'm just gonna rig it weightless on the circle hook. We're just we're just going off the cuff on this one. I'm gonna see, will Guggen baits work in the ocean, man? In the salt water? That's what we wanna know. This is, the, this is the question you've all been asking. You haven't asked it all, actually, I'm just kidding, but I'm just gonna test. Watch this. You ready to see some shenaniganry? Look at that. That's juicy. It's kind of about the quality of the, oh my God, the shark is on the toad. No freaking way. I, I want that shark right now. No way. I'm gonna get him. That was insane. The shark was following the explode toad. I would love to see it. Devin's on with another snook out back. What's going on guys? This is Captain Jason Dozier. We've been fishing all day with Weston and his wife, Devin and we've been catching a bunch of snook. We are out here in the wind today. We got Tropical Storm Edda. Edda? Edda, Edda. 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 <laughs> we, got, we got Tropical Storm Edda on the horizon, and I think the fish are gonna be chewing. So we've been catching a bunch of snook today. We probably caught, I don't know, 15, 20 snook. We caught, she caught one small red, a bunch of jacks. And now we're gonna go ahead and roll over and go try to catch some big breeder redfish over on Super Secret Spot, Tampa Bay. All right, y'all, so we just made a big move. We're over here watching some bald, well, not some bald eagles, but a bald eagle cruising down here, going after some fish, throwing out some chummers. We got a couple uh, lines in the water. We tossed out a couple greenbacks, but chopped the tails off of them. Apparently, these reds key in on some scent, and so we're trying to give them just that, but also we might get a big old snook on the line. We just saw a big one bust over here, maybe potential 40 inches. so let's see what we can get. It's a little breezy out here, but, uh, but this is where the big ones are, y'all, so stick with us. All right guys, what an amazing day. The big reds did elude us. We did catch the one, we got the slam, man. Thanks to Devin, always getting outfished by the wife. But needless to say, it was a little choppy and the hurricane was approaching, which is why a trip of Jason's actually got canceled and he ended up inviting us out on the house. So Jason, thank you so much, my man. We actually got hit up by a lot of charters while we were out in Florida and just random locals uh, wanting to take us out in exchange for video work to promote their service. Jason didn't even ask for that, but of course we're gonna document, we're gonna film, and we're gonna have a good time regardless. So we made an awesome video. And if you guys are in the area of Tampa Bay, definitely give him a look, hit him up. He can put you on just about any species you want to catch in that area, but also, he does destination trips to places like Louisiana, the Florida Keys, and he knows his stuff. He's been fishing his whole life in these areas, so go ahead and hit him up, guys. It's gonna be in the description. He's also got his own YouTube channel and Instagram page. I've got it all there for you. But guys, thank you so much for sticking around till the end. Let us know where we should try and go fish next when it comes to destinations, not local. We've got plenty of opportunities, and we would love to do some more traveling and catch some more new species. So what is it that you want to see us catch over on the channel? Aside from the usual largemouth bass, kayak, bank, and boat fishing videos that we do on a day-to-day -day basis. Thank y'all, and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace out. <gasps>